formal application. The form should really be the last thing that you complete and include in the application. There's two main reasons for that. One, the forms are extremely tedious, most of them, and they require a lot of information. Um, and it takes a long time to complete those, dog, those forms. Now, while you're completing these forms, let's say if that's the first thing you're going to do, you could have spent time collecting the necessary documents. The second reason why it's important to leave the forms in the end is because they get updated so frequently. The last thing you want to do is start with the forms and then finish those, put those aside, get the documents together, only to go back to the forms that have now been updated and you have to restart the engine again. So whatever application you're submitting, whether it's under the family class, the economic class, make sure that you collect the necessary documents first, then complete the forms. Now, I do recommend, however, though, that as soon as you know what application you're submitting, look at the forms, because those forms do guide you as to what kind of documents you need to support your argument. So take a look at the forms, make some notes as to what they're trying to ask for these forms, and then go back to collecting the necessary documents. Do not complete the forms until the end. It will save you some time and headache of possibly redoing it again. If you're looking at filing an application, um, give us a call today. We're here to help you move forward. Thank you, and until next time.